Hey everyone, welcome to a brand new video on this channel. If you look around in this channel, you'll see a lot of coding videos. And don't get me wrong, I love coding. But mixing it up from time to time is a very good idea. And if you ask me, one thing I like most about being a freelancer is that I can pick my projects, that I can decide how I approach a project and that I can generally control how I work. That, that is something I really, really enjoy. And if you sit in front of a desk coding in the same language for 10 to 12 hours a day, well, that can get very annoying. And of course, I do have those sprints too. But I really love it if I also get to do some designing work, creating a web design for a client, creating some assets, or doing something completely different. If you look at my Vita, you might recognize that I've not always worked as a developer. I started business administration, I worked in a bank and in a consultancy, and it's that mix that I really love. Now back to this video, what will we do in this series? We will have a look at Photoshop and Illustrator. Or is it this way? I hope it's this way, this way. So whatever. Um, Photoshop and Illustrator are two very important tools when doing web design too. And we will learn what the differences are, what we do in Photoshop, what we do in Illustrator, and obviously how to use those tools. We will create a lot of examples. This will be not really a series, which is, let's say, 20 videos long, but it will be ongoing. We will create different assets, different kind of designs, mix it up with some coding. So really, really fun series. Now let's have a closer look at Photoshop and Illustrator in the next video.